what exactly are the empty branches of the wave function in Bohmian mechanics? In Bohmian mechanics, the empty branches of the wave function are certain parts of the wave function that do not influence the dynamics of the particles. Take the example of a Schrödinger cat-like experiment. You know that if the wave function of the atom is in a superposition of decayed and not decayed, then the wave function of the cat will be in a superposition of life and dead. But in Bohmian mechanics, the particles that the cat is actually made of are either in the support of the life part of the wave function or of the dead part of the wave function. So the wave packet where the particles are not in, you could call empty, since it doesn't play any role anymore for the dynamics of the particles, at least for a very long time. That is so because both wave packets are so far separated in configuration space that it's practically impossible for them to ever interfere again. This is usually called decoherence. Of course, there are also instances where the empty branches can become important again, namely when, after a while, the wave packets come closer and start to interfere again. However, as a rule of thumb, for big systems, this is prevented by decoherence. The situation that parts of a field are empty is actually very common in physics. A good example is the Newtonian gravitational field. At places where there is no matter, its value doesn't play any role for the dynamics of the actual matter. The Newtonian gravitational field in empty parts of space is, so to say, also empty. The same is true for the electric Coulomb field, which doesn't play any role where there is no charged matter.